Hello, dear Taurus. Welcome to your September 2022 New Versus Them reading, or whenever you happen to come across it, when you're guided to see it, is when you're meant to see it. Okay, so this is your side. This is your person's side. We're starting with you. What are your thoughts about your person? What are your thoughts? Ooh, King of Pentacles. All righty. Let's see here. Hmm. Okay. Your thoughts are to walk away from something. Maybe you're leaving something behind to be with this person. Or maybe your thoughts are hoping they will do that. This is the King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So this could be that you're seeing them as doing quite well financially, very stable, very reliable. But either you or them left, one of you left someone out in the cold here. And this person, your thoughts are they make you happy though. Leo energy. Okay, let's clarify. Why is the King of Pentacles here for your thoughts about that? Let's see. Page of Swords. Hmm. You watching them? Um, this is like maybe you're watching what they're doing or you realize that they are doing quite well. The Page of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. This is, um, they call it to be learning something new or doing something new that you're noticing. But here, this could be that you're watching their social media, you're, you're checking them out. Or you're asking friends about them, inquiring about them. So your thoughts are to find out what they're really up to. What about this um, Five of Pentacles? The Hierophant, this is your card. You want commitment. That's what you think. You like to have commitment with this person. What about the Sun card? I mean, they do make you happy. Why is that here? Ooh, Ace of Swords, getting to the truth, cutting out whatever does not belong, and starting something new. Knight of Pentacles. Are you thinking going towards them? Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Maybe make an offer slow and steady. Okay, let's see what their thoughts are about you. What are their thoughts about you? Judgment. Page of Pentacles. Okay, so they're trying to decide whether they want to bring this back around. They're thinking about making an offer here with the Page of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. They have a lot of passion for you. They may also see you very creative here. They're looking between the these two wands here. They're holding on to the wand for the past. And they're thinking of you. So yeah, I think they, they might have you on their mind here. Okay, so why is the judgment card here? Why is the judgment card here? Ooh, ace of wands again. Okay. This person is, <laughs> is really thinking about you. <laughs> with a lot of passion and desire. What about this um, Page of Pentacles? Ooh, the Emperor. So may they're thinking of you being as a little controlling or maybe being in power. Yeah, they might see you as being very powerful. A leader. Someone that's established. That's Aries energy. Okay, and what about this Ace of Wands? Why is that here? Ooh, the chariot. They want to come quickly to you. They want to rush this along. They're manifesting here. I see the magicians, Aries, and Aquarius energy. <coughs> if I got tickled. They have the four cups. Then maybe they're thinking that you won't take their offer. Or that could be a missed opportunity. Maybe someone missed an opportunity here. Okay, now let's see. What are your feelings for your person? What are your feelings? It's been a burden. Ooh, here's the emperor. And so are you seeing them as the emperor too? And the queen of pentacles? You're feeling that maybe they're um, very controlling or maybe they're in charge of something or they have established something well in their life. Could be Aries. Um, also queen of pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You can see them very nurturing, caring, doing well with the money. We have the king of pentacles and the queen of pentacles. Unless you're seeing both of you guys together would make a great couple, a very stable couple. We do have the Nine of Cups that you feel for them. All right, so Queen of Pentacles, they might keep a nice home or they're very nurturing, caring, and you like that about them. Okay, let's see. What about the Ten of Wands? Ooh, Two of Pentacles. Okay, maybe you're trying to figure out how to balance this out. Trying to make this work. This is a burden. 
maybe you have a lot of burdens you know how to make this work with them or that you see them have a lot of burden the emperor three of pentacles i think you think you guys could work well together you're feeling that their energy as if you see them as the emperor they see you as the emperor yeah very strong personalities then what about the queen of pentacles Ooh, the tower okay and we have the devil Ooh, so you, you might be obsessing over this or maybe you think they're obsessing because you're feeling for them is something that is shocking here it's shocking yourself how much you feel for them or how how caring you see them or something is shocking to you or you might want to shock them me you're feeling art to shock them to come in and shock them the devil energy is like i feel like someone's very obsessed over this either you feel them obsessed or possessive or jealous someone is here okay what about um their feelings for you we have ooh, they want commitment here okay we have the hierophant okay you just shuffle a little more i wasn't ready for that it popped out and shuffle a little bit more and that's your energy taurus energy so you won't get the hierophant all of a sudden they might feel like you're hiding something hiding emotions or they're hiding their emotions okay and we have here someone's thinking about this three of swords here wants to heal that ah they're also worried about some kind um some kind of um deceit the betrayal or some kind of gossip or something that happened here and someone had to walk away because they're was just like it was a losing battle so it feels like there's something hidden here pisces energy taurus energy and then here trying to heal from this three of swords could have been something that broke you up it's um it could have been a third party situation and that could be a person that could be a bunch of people that could be um a place that could be anything addiction okay why do we have the hierophant here Ooh, the sun okay the, this person feels like you make you they would be very happy to be in a commitment with you and they're afraid that if they make you an offer you might not want to take it because there's there's hidden emotions they don't know how you feel they wish they knew how you feel and then okay so now they're taking a break and i think they want to come in as a knight of wands aries leo sagittarius and also the page of wands they want to get a message to you they want to talk so you might hear from this person they might come either flying in they're feeling they're trying to think do i just show up or maybe that's where this is that you may even be surprised by this person show up. or do they get a message to you a text an email a phone call or a letter you know or come by your place your house your work okay so now let's see what action might you take towards them what is the action you might take towards them let's see Ooh, ten of pentacles nine of wands okay okay you're taking the time out too you're trying to heal from this or, or take a break here you would you would like commitment here but you're standing a little protective here you're very defensive but you would like to work on this okay let's see let's clarify this now why is it ten of pentacles here oh ace of cups you have a lot of love for this person what about this nine of wands okay so you might you might leave something behind to go towards this person you might have to walk away from something in order to have this not of this ace of cups with them but and you're trying to get the strength to do so i think okay leo energy but there is a lot of sleepless nights worrying about things here you're going through a lot of stress here okay worrying about this connection let's see what action might they take towards you what is the action they might take towards you Ooh, they might come in fast to work on this together a partnership and they're also going to be very defensive here they're going to protect this connection or they want or they fear they have to protect this connection and then we have the knight of wands again this person wants to come flying in towards you they have a lot of passion for you very strong passion here passion and desire and want and commitment okay and this is aquarius libra gemini energy aries leo sagittarius okay let's clarify this psalm um, knight of swords undecided how to do this not seeing the full picture or not wanting to see the full picture what about this three of pentacles okay they also got the work card they really want to work on this they're willing to put the work in either that or both of you are putting too much time into your own work 
instead of getting together you're focusing on your work we have the ace of swords here wanting the truth you have the ace of swords here so the truth has to come out also here comes this knight of cups coming in with this love offer okay this person really wants to offer you something or you know come in and have a discussion i think you both want to have a discussion here let's see what your mutual energy is what is the mutual feelings and mutual energy between the two of you we have transformation a huge breakthrough is happening soon Ooh, i like that and then we have very soon the waiting is over decision needs to be made Ooh, whoa those cards went flying okay let me see i'm gonna pick those up okay oh my gosh okay so we got three that came flying out okay nurture i have to put it this way i guess Wait, let me just read this nurture self-love is essential a time to address your needs and ground yourself and then a letter is coming there are they are reaching out to communicate news or messages are coming soon and then we have romance your feelings are real and worth exploring okay so you're definitely going to be communicating and at the bottom of the deck we have book gain more knowledge use your intuition to see the answers okay listen to that so you got the extra cards that came out with this person because there's going to be a letter someone's going to write a letter or some kind of form of communication could be another form of communication but that's the way it is. so even if they call they email they text it's still going to come okay now let's see what are the messages they want to say to you what do they want you to know what do they want to say to you maybe that they're afraid to say to you let's see what we get here you've been in my dreams aha okay you might be connecting on the fifth dimension here with this person okay and i'm in a much better headspace now okay that's good and i know you're right but i need to come to my own conclusions okay remember take what resonates leave what doesn't and have um i feel safer in the silence okay and i want to be authentic i'm no longer afraid okay so you want you're going to see their true self now there is a transformation so and we have i feel damaged like i just can't do this Ooh. okay so of course we're getting different energy from different people because there it's like one saying one thing one saying something else so it's gonna be different for everyone i can't handle your words right now on the bottom of the deck okay let's get some more messages put this over here so i have room put this over here for these okay what else what else do you need to hear we have i care too much about what others think right now and i know i made a huge mistake it's really hard to for me to open up and I'm still haunted by my actions. There are still so many unsaid things between us. And I'm afraid to take that next step right now. Hmm. But this says very soon this is going to happen. So this person right now at this time, they might be feeling that. But when you see this reading, it might be different or it might, they might, something might just happen because there is a transformation. Even though I don't show it, I'm sorry for how things went between us okay there we go with that now let's see what signs we could be dealing with for taurus what are the signs please what are the signs for taurus we have libra cancer sagittarius libra again wow sagittarius wow and capricorn okay so these can place in your chart placement in their chart um past present future people we have libra cancer sagittarius libra sagittarius and capricorn now for the letters so we'll see what letters want to come up for initials first name last name and then if someone has a middle name you know that initial you get that one also all the better past present and future and also your own initials let's see here we have f f I O 
J. L. Z. T. N. Y. L. Okay, so letters we have for you today are F F I O J L Z T N Y L. And now for the names. Let's see what names we have here for Taurus. What are the names, please? Eleven or more names. Okay. Okay, we have Vantonio. We have Matthew. We have Chandra, C H A N D A, Maureen, Lori with two R's, Chloe, Roxanne, Valerie, Yvette, Y V E T T E, and Corey, and Mikhail, M E C H I E L. I don't know how to pronounce that one. Okay, and I have 11 here. Perfect. Okay, guys, so remember, these are general readings, not person readings. Please just take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Some of it might resonate, some of it might not. And with the messages, you'll know if that's from your person. You know how they, they act, how they talk, how they feel. You'll you'll know. It'll feel right to you, too. So um, please let me know if it does resonate. Please leave comments. I love you guys so much, and I appreciate all your likes, your shares, your subscribes, and your comments. And I hope to see you all again real soon. Thank you so much.